Hi everyone. Well, today I decided to come to the cemetery to where we buried Noah and Sophia. And, uh, yeah, you know, and I usually sit down and do like a whole talking thing with my videos, but I thought maybe this one I'd bring you guys along with me and bring you to the cemetery. Um, you know, forgive me for the, the lighting and all that good stuff. You know, work with what we got, right? So, yeah, this is the cemetery. I'm here and I, it's been about, um, almost a full month really since I've been here. Actually, it has been a full 30 days since I've been here. Um, Noah's birthday was the last time I was here, so on December 12th. It's been really cold and then holidays and not feeling good and working and videoing, you know. So, yeah, don't always get out here very often. But we've had a lot of really windy days, so I just wanted to make sure everything was okay and see where things were at. So here we go. There's their, their headstone. Oh, here's a piece actually of that I had part of their decorations. Here we go. Some of it's a little messy. Not too terribly bad. And the tree here. <laughs> Looks like it just kind of gone all got blown over here. Just have to pick some of this up. And straighten a lot of this out here. Wondering maybe I might just take some of this down. Some of this really got a beating. <laughs> These signs and stuff. It's actually really pretty out here. I take some of this back. Looks like there's a new grave there. The mountains, they're there. I used to come out here quite a bit, or I do actually in the spring and summer, and I have a chair, a nice chair, and sit out here, read, write, pray, talk to Noah and Sophia, to heaven my mom and dad now it's really hard to see the mountains in this shot the sun it's really really close I'm sorry yeah Let's see some of the stuff got in the back fell candy canes I tell you what it's like this is a shock it's definitely very unnatural this whole thing is extremely unnatural very unnatural should not be a place any mother should be coming to. Any father. So it looks like all my flowers are gone. It takes me a minute sometimes to realize, but I had a whole bunch of flowers there, very beautiful Christmas flowers. And they're all gone. You know, we had a couple days where it was about 55, 
to 65 mile an hour winds so it was it was yeah <laughs> those days so I imagine I'm grateful that this is what was left here and I but you know I always buy my items mostly from the Dollar Tree or Walmart try not to spend very much money on them just for this reason right here you know you never know the weather everything's outside the weather so I don't want to be all super upset if I lose something or it gets gone well guys thank you for coming with me here I think I'm gonna probably put the camera down so I can clean this up tidy it up a little bit So when I come back, I'm going to bring some more flowers for you, Noah and Fifi. I love to have the flowers here. The cemetery is pretty cleaned up. They keep it pretty clean around here, so I don't really see them, like, you know, strung across anywhere, really. On the ground. Now there's a couple flowers. I don't know. That's a wreath on somebody else's, but maybe that flower over there, but there's some flowers strung randomly over there. Oh, I wonder if that's his balloon popped on the ground over there. We had Noah's birthday balloons tied around here too. Well, don't want to leave these things. All right, guys. Well, thought I'd jump back on real quick because I hit the button again. <laughs> I do that so well. Oh my gosh, that's all I do is hit that button. I'm sorry. <laughs> but thank you for coming with me out here to the cemetery. Thank you. It is a beautiful day today. It makes it more easier to tolerate coming out here with the and it's sunny at least right yeah so well thank you guys let me put my camera down and get this stuff cleaned up so i will see you next time god bless you and be well